Hey, it's Skylar. How are you all doing? I hope you're doing very well. I feel like shit. <coughs> As you guys know, I do have coronavirus for the second time. And I need to get a couple of videos uploaded. So. And I still feel like crap. But I will say this. Lays are freaking amazing. I love this stuff. And these are incredible. Extra triple action, that's what you need. So yeah, been taking them regularly and exacto such. And then in a couple of hours I've got to take my Cavonia. Yeah, I, I, I have to have Cavonia as well. Because that helps my throat so I can try and eat something but I haven't really been eating too good so sorry for the short and short intro and yes I'm drinking still spring water that's cost 17p in Lidl <laughs> yeah so we have a mixture of a mail day here I think we have some movies here. We have photographs and we have someone's vessel for me for Christmas. But I I can't wait till Christmas. I have to open mine unless it's wrapped up. So we'll do the opened ones first and then actually do unboxing. As you know, I love a company called Free Prints. I finally got back on board with a few little bits. So, yeah, these will be going in my photo frame, which will be going into the new house. So, as you guys know, who my favourite wrestler is. So, we don't even have to go into anything right now. So, these will be going in the new photo frame. Um, yeah, even my nose is runny as well. So, we have them. So, yeah. Plenty of bug roll tissue on hand. <coughs> <coughs> and yes, I am behaving myself by self-isolating as well. So yeah. It was weird because I was supposed to have gone away last night. But my appointment for my PCR test was really early in the morning. Like half eight, so I got me appointments on the test and around about half 10 half 11 i was like oh results i then i looked at my results and i was like oh shit i can't go away so luckily i phoned up my dad dad phoned up the travel agents they got me flights put back for a few weeks so i'll be going away then feeling my dream coming on as well so you are probably wondering why I'm sitting in my old house in my old living room is because obviously self isolate and I have the house to myself. So yeah, the first film that is not envelope because I already opened it is Medea, um, which is directed by Pier Paolo Pasolini, the very, very, very controversial director that directed 100, 120 days of Sodom. Yeah. Which is also known as Salo. So, yeah. So, I wanted to watch one of his other, other, other movies. But apparently, Salo was his most controversial one. And then, of course, I love me some Tinto Brass. I love me some Tinto Brass and of course I have a film called The Key I only need two maybe three more I think three more films to complete my Tinto Brass collection um, Tinto Brass was one of those um, controversial directors in the 70s that like to push the brown boundaries and show a little bit of nudity. 
so. <clears throat> so, yeah, the key. Um, if you've seen um, Salon Kitty, um, most of the characters from Salon, Salon Kitty were actually in Salo, 120 Days of Sodom, so... So, this is the one I'm going to open last, because this, this gift means a lot to me, and it was because Pedro bought me it for Christmas, and it'll probably be set aside with the other stuff for Christmas. Even the films are for me for Christmas, but I, I, I can't watch them yet until Christmas, so at least I'm making sure that I can watch some films for Christmas and then I have this one <laughs> which is so hard to get out of the packaging um, as you guys know I do like my giallos and this is a film by Luciano Icoli and this was um came out in 1970 so from 1970 to like the early 90s that was like period giallo a lot of the italian directors made giallo films and this one is supposed to be a really really amazing one and i'm glad i have it in my collection at a decent price as you guys know i am a fan of Arrow video as you as you can tell <laughs> And this is the forbidden photos of a lady above suspicion. So, yeah. And I just found out today, um, obviously because I have COVID as well, my ex went to my new house. He, he's got my keys and everything. I'm so excited. But obviously I can't look in the house because of COVID. Because I have corona. Um and basically he went to me you never guess what one of the bedrooms has got a load of shelves in it for your movies i was like what he went you can use your shelf but you've got a load of shelf and i was like ah it is right and i went well you know that's your room right and he was like yeah yeah i don't care i'll have your movies in my room <laughs> <coughs> so yeah another movie sorry about me coughing and then i've got another two here um, these actually only cost one pound fifty three. This next one, I don't know how much that one cost. Yeah, one fifty three. The classes it is a a large letter, second class. So like second class large letter here is only one pound fifty three, and yeah, seven movies. Freaking hell. <coughs> Thank God I've got a region free player so I can play this. So when we were talking about Giallo's, this is all the colours of Giallo. And there's, it's a free disc. Oh my God, I got this at an amazing place as well. Free disc. I can't believe there's free discs in this. So all the colours of Giallo, five and a half hours of classic trailers. Ooh. So we've got Federico Cadeo in this. Um, John Martin, Kat Ellinger, which is and it's got a bit of Sergio Martino in this. Trailer compilation for a criminal, the case of Crimmy, or Creamy, and then it's got something about Marcus Steigler, and then a bit more by Enrico Di Gemini. <coughs> so this is worth a watch in itself. So if you are a fan of Giallo's, get this. So. I still have another unboxing to go, so I'm going to do that separately. 
can't believe we're 10 minutes in and I've done one, two, three, four, and now number five. Oh, the next one is also by Pierre Paolo Pasolini. I did show you this one. Now I have the Decameron. The Cameron. By Pierre Paolo Pasolini. This came out in 1970. The Medea. Medea came out in... 1970 as well so so I now have three three films and I've got another one coming on its way as well so yeah so uh, I have five new movies <coughs> and we're 11 minutes in so, and now it's this one. Um, this was Pedro's idea. He said, I'm going to treat you to sort of, because I need to cheer you up a little bit. And I was like, no, you don't. I said, I've got enough this Christmas. I've got the house. To hopefully going into and starting to decorate. So you... And he's like, well, no, you'll need this as well. Oh, my word. I'm literally in fucking tears right now. <sighs> this is incredible. Oh my goodness. That's my two inspirations. That's Jessica Cow and Wardlow. Oh. I literally can't stop crying right now because this is incredible. Imagine me drinking this on Christmas freaking day. <coughs> Put on my, my coffee or my energy fizz or something like that. This is incredible. I'm going to have to send this to Jess. I'll go, you never guess what Peter's just got me. Sent for me for Christmas as an early Christmas present and I opened it up because it was in my name. Didn't realise. She'll be like, oh my word. She'll be like, that's so cool. <laughs> She'll be going, I'm on a mug or something like that. But this, nobody else has this in the world. This is mine. And I am just like, I just want to cry so much. I feel like crying my eyes out because like, I never expected this. I thought, it, do you know what? I actually thought Pedro was going to get me a ward local. But to have this is even better. <laughs> oh my word, that's just like incredible. Like that's just amazing. Freaking hell. I'm gonna have to show I'm gonna have to show Jess that. She's gonna literally bl get blown away. I'm gonna be like, oh my word. <laughs> that's like I'm just like I'm stunned. I'm stunned completely. And I've still got another unboxing to go, which is a Jessica Co related as well. Oh my word, I need to get some photos of this. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. And I'll talk to you guys soon. So yeah, stay gory and have unpleasant dreams. And excuse my voice because it's terrible. Ciao, ciao.